In the plains of East Washington, you can find signs of a vast, ancient wonder. Well, I'm in Dry Falls State Park, and this was one of the places that really first inspired this entire filming journey of telling the story of the Lake Missoula floods. Dry Falls are so called because they were a massive waterfall that now has no water at all. When the Lake Missoula floods came through, they fell off of this precipice. And this particular waterfall is the largest waterfall we know having existed. It's three and a half miles wide and places 400 feet tall. And the Lake Missoula floods would have just fallen down as a roiling muddy mess jumping off of the cliff and just pummeling the landscape below. You know, if you were there, you would be able to feel the falls and hear them from such a long distance away. 10 times the flow of all the world's rivers combined flying off of this cliff face that extends for three and a half miles. So it's just this, this epic, epic event of the ice ages that it just feels so good to be here and bring it to life. Walking through the canyon by dry falls, volcanic boulders litter the ground as echoes of now silent catastrophe. landscape whispers stories of an ancient wall of water. Peace in the shadow of cataclysm. Here, Lake Missoula put its might on full display. Looking at the torn chunks of rock, I couldn't help but feel like I was walking through a battlefield that time forgot. Thousands of years ago, this was the site of one of our planet's wonders, a titanic waterfall that dwarfs the thought of any other. Here, thunder roared as 3.5 miles of water launched into the depths below. An ice age titan making the ground tremble. Through vast erosional forces, the falls tore the landscape to pieces, migrating 15 miles from where they once stood. And so I walked through a realm of time-frozen memories. Lake Missoula stampeded its way through here for the last time 13,000 years ago. And it is this final event, long dormant and silent, that I bring to life to your eyes. I am chasing Lake Missoula. This place is so utterly mind-blowing. It's so wild 
that you know the classic notion in geology is those of processes that you see today taking place over huge amounts of time you know rivers flowing and through that flow eventually wearing down vast chasms and the events that occurred here with the Lake Missoula floods in Washington this landscape was just sundered you know it's like an angry god took its fist and slammed it into the landscape and rock went everywhere right all the soils are gone and you know many layers of volcanic rock were eroded in an instant it's astonishing and right here i'm sitting just underneath the world's largest waterfall at one point in time three and a half miles wide you can just see it it goes all across the horizon off in that direction and the water would have just flown off of that gotten into this gorge and then just proceeded to tear apart the landscape barely recognizing that it took a steep drop hellbent on the pacific ocean what a place what an event it's fitting to think of dry falls as a monument to the epic forces of nature in reverie this is my temple Until next time, wander in wonder.